nice to finally get some healthy bodies back in the lineup and contributing as you, with J.C. LeBon and Seth Griffith. Yeah, it, it changes the dynamic of uh, how we roll the lines and, and the special teams um, brings uh, J.C. Um, brings a lot of energy to our team, um, competes every shift. Uh, he's moving quick. He's br he brings a lot of speed too. And Seth, um, he's, a, he's a veteran player. He can make plays. Um, so it, it changes, uh, changes a lot. Post Christmas, you know, obviously we know what happened with your team and you, the injuries are still there. But did you notice a change from the outset of today's game that you wanted to see from your team today? Well, I think uh, today we were uh, tracking way better. Um, and, and that's one of the reasons why we created more offense. So tracking, when you lose puck control or puck possession and you come back hard, which is basic hockey, right? But it's, uh, it's more than that. It's, it's uh, the gap from our D um, in neutral zone and backside pressure, taking away their second and third options. And I think um, that, was, um, that was much better today than it was before the Christmas break. Going to say about a player, a player like Skyler McKenzie, who obviously was coming off of injury, and you moved him up into the top six. Well, he, he, every time we've played him a bit more, he's uh, he took advantage of his uh, opportunity. So um, we, we decided to give him a chance uh, with different players, and and he, again he responded well. So good for him. 38 saves from Eric Comrie today. He was obviously the story of the game. It didn't seem like the Colorado had that much pressure and direct that many shots on your net but obviously 38 saves 38 saves what can you say about your net minor today well he was really good I think I think um, he was really good at controlling the rebounds uh, lots of shots from different angles but not too many second and third chances after the first one so I think we played uh, good in front of him but he was really good at uh, managing those pucks and shots towards him and redirecting those pucks in the corners is there any uh, change for tomorrow, or do you kind of maintain the same game plan as what you saw from today's 60-minute effort? Oh, we'll study the game, uh, the game tape, and uh, we'll see if we make any adjustments. Obviously, uh, there's always something to work on, um, so we'll, we'll see what we uh, if we make any adjustments. Uh, one Moose Jets-related question: Obviously, with Dustin Bufflin injured, Jets are going to need to make a recall. Do you anticipate? Who, them making a recall today or tomorrow, or will you have the full same roster? And if it is, do you know who it will be? Um, we have uh, an idea, um, but nothing is confirmed yet. I, uh, that's the, the first thing I did when I uh, came back to the coach's room is to check uh, my, my text messages, and I didn't receive anything yet. So uh, right now it's status quo.